Good evening, and thank you for joining me to pray the rosary tonight. I'm Scott, and I'll be praying with you from my home here in De Pere, Wisconsin, as we do every Monday night. Today is Monday, July 5th, 2021, Rosary Garden, episode number 46. So, yeah, we're just coming off the 4th of July weekend, and of, of course, yesterday we celebrated um, the declaration of our independence from Great Britain, and I figured, um, given this uh, holiday weekend and the importance of yesterday's holiday here in the United States, um, that I figured we would pray the, the patriotic rosary tonight. Uh, so I know I've got a few. I don't know if we have any right now listening in, whether it's live or whether it's um, on the podcast. But if you're not from the United States, I hope you'll um, follow along just as well and appreciate um, the freedoms that we have and that we're praying for here in the U.S. Um, so if you're not familiar with the patriotic rosary, um, first of all, this is a rosary that I, I did not know about a, a year ago. I just learned it last fall. The Patriotic Rosary, it's the same rosary that we've always prayed together. Um, we use the same rosary. I'm holding up one here that I made a month or two ago. Um, so we're going to pray all the same prayers, but there's going to be additional prayers, which I will lead you through. So before we pray each Hail Mary, um, I will uh, state an intention for that Hail Mary. Um, and then before we start each decade, um, I will read a, a small passage from a, a speech um, or a writing from an American patriot. Um, so again, if you're if you're not familiar with the Patriotic Rosary, don't worry about it. Just follow along, get your rosary out, and I think you'll catch on pretty pretty quickly. Um, since I'm reading a lot of passages and speeches and things like that, I've got it all on paper. This is not memorized. So um, um, bear with me if you see me pausing for a moment. I might be flipping a page or turning a page over or something like that. So uh, we'll get started uh, right away. And tonight, um, throughout, we will we'll be meditating on the joyful mysteries, um, since this is the um, this is the uh, um, first Monday of the month. So I always start the month on the joyful mysteries. So we'll begin as always in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your faithful and kindle in them the fire of your love. Send forth your Spirit, and they shall be created, and you shall renew the face of the earth. O God, who by the light of the Holy Spirit did instruct the hearts of the faithful, grant that by the same Holy Spirit we may be truly wise and ever enjoy his consolations through Christ our Lord. Amen. For the conversion of our nation's capital, I believe in God the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. For the Holy Father, Pope Francis, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. For the bishops of our country, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For the priests and deacons in our country. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For the religious of our country. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For the conversion of of our country. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Let us consider these words from President George Washington from June 29th, 1788, as we meditate on the first joyful mystery, the Annunciation. No one can rejoice more than I do at every step the people of this great country take to preserve the union, establish good order and government, 
and to render the nation happy at home and respectable abroad. No country upon earth ever had it more in its power to attain these blessings than united America. Wondrously strange then, and much to be regretted indeed would it be, were we to, ne to neglect the means and to depart from the road which providence has pointed us so plainly. I cannot believe that it will ever come to pass. The great governor of the universe has led us too long and too far on the road to happiness and glory to forsake us in the midst of it. By folly and improper conduct, proceeding from a variety of causes, we may now and then get bewildered. But I hope and trust that there is good sense and virtue enough left to recover the right path before we shall be entirely lost. For the presidency of the United States of America, our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Alabama and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Alaska and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Arizona and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Arkansas and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over California and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Colorado and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Connecticut and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Delaware and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Florida and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Georgia and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For the conversion of our country, glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Let us consider these words from John Adams, from July 3rd, 1776, as we meditate on the second joyful mystery, the visitation. It may be the will of heaven that America shall suffer calamities, still more wasting, and distresses yet more dreadful. If this is to be the case, it will have this good effect, at least. It will inspire us with many virtues which we have not, and correct many errors, follies, and vices, 
which threaten to disturb, dishonor, and destroy us. The furnace of affliction produces refinement in states as well as individuals, and the new governments we are assuming in every part will require a purification from our vices and an augmentation of our virtues, or there will be no blessings. But I must submit all my hopes and fears to an overruling providence, in which, unfashionable as the faith may be, I firmly believe. For the Supreme Court of the United States of America, our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Hawaii and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Idaho and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Illinois in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Indiana in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Iowa, in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Kansas in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Kentucky in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Louisiana in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Maine in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Maryland in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For the conversion of our country. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Let us consider these words from Associate Justice of the Supreme Court, James Iredell, from May 1st, 1778 as we meditate on the third joyful mystery, the birth of Jesus. Review the great scenes of history. You will find mankind has always been obliged to pay dear for the blessings they enjoyed. The struggles of a great people have almost always ended in the establishment of liberty. Such a people are spoken of with admiration by all future ages. Their souls glow with gratitude for the virtue and self-denial of their forefathers. They consider them as patterns for their own conduct on similar occasions and are continually pointing them out to the reverence and imitation of their children. These are the glorious effects of patriotism and virtue. 
These are the rewards annexed to the faithful discharge, that great and honorable duty, fidelity to our country. I pray to God that the fair character I have described may be that of America to the latest ages. For the Senate and the House of Representatives of the United States of America, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Massachusetts in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Michigan in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Minnesota and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Mississippi and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Missouri and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Montana in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Nebraska in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Nevada in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over New Hampshire in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over New Jersey in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For the conversion of our country, glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Let us consider these words from geographer Jedediah Morse from 1799 as we meditate on the fourth joyful mystery, the presentation. To the kindly influence of Christianity, we owe that degree of civil freedom and political and social happiness which mankind now enjoys. In proportion as the genuine effects of Christianity are diminished in any nation, either through unbelief or through the corruption of its doctrines or the neglect of its institutions, in that same proportion will the people of that nation recede from the blessings of genuine freedom and approximate the miseries of complete despotism. All efforts to destroy the foundations of our holy religion ultimately tend to the subversion also of our political freedom and happiness. Whenever the pillars of Christianity shall be overthrown, our present republican forms of government 
and all the blessings which flow from them must fall with them. For the office of the governors of the United States of America. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over New Mexico in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over New York in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over North Carolina in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over North Dakota in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Ohio and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Oklahoma in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Oregon in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Pennsylvania in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Rhode Island in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over South Carolina in every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For the conversion of our country, glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Let us consider these words from General Robert E. Lee from 1863, as we meditate on the fifth joyful mystery, finding the child Jesus in the temple. Soldiers, let us humble ourselves before the Lord our God, asking through Christ the forgiveness of our sins, beseeching the aid of the God of our forefathers in the defense of our homes and our liberties, thanking him for his past blessings and imploring their continuance upon our cause and our people. Knowing that intercessory prayer is our mightiest weapon and the supreme call for all Christians today, I pleadingly urge our people everywhere to pray. Believing that prayer is the greatest contribution that our people can make in this critical hour, I humbly urge that we take time to pray, to really pray. Let there be prayer at sunup, at noonday, at sundown, and at midnight, all through the day. Let us pray for our children, our youth, and our aged, our pastors, and our homes. Let us pray for the churches. Let us pray for ourselves that we might, we may, 
that we may not lose the word concern out of our Christian vocabulary. Let us pray for our nation. Let us pray for those who have never known Jesus Christ and his redeeming love, for moral forces everywhere, for our national leaders. Let prayer be our passion. Let prayer be our practice. For all county and municipal offices of the United States of America, our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over South Dakota and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Tennessee and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Texas and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Utah and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Vermont and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Virginia and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Washington and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over West Virginia and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Wisconsin and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We plead the blood of Jesus over Wyoming and every soul in that state. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For the conversion of our country, glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious Advocate, thine eyes of mercy toward us. And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, grant, we beseech thee, that by meditating upon these mysteries of the most holy rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise, through the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. St. Michael the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and the snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, 
by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who prowl about the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. St. Joseph, patron of the Universal Church and guardian of the Blessed Virgin Mary and the child Jesus, the Son of God whom she carried in her immaculate womb, intercede for us, we pray, that all recourse to abortion might cease in our nation and our world. As you cared for mother and child, care for all women who bear the gift of life in their womb. May no harm ever endanger them, and may no choice ever threaten the blessing of human life that God has created within. Guard them with your loving protection at every moment until his will has been fulfilled. St. Joseph, spouse of Mary and foster father of the Lord, help us build a culture of life that yields a civilization of love among us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. So that was pretty cool, huh? The Patriotic Rosary. Um, I'm glad that you um, were able to, to join me for that. Um, I recognize a few people in the chat on YouTube. Brian, good chatting with you this past week, too, on, by text message. There's some good stuff out there. I think you and I are seeing eye to eye on this stuff. Um, and Mark and Kelly, good to see you guys, as always. As always. I'm thinking about you guys this month, five years. Good to have you guys as friends. I appreciate you. Um, Sir Jan, it's especially good to see you. I know you're not in America. You're not even American. And I think you're in Canada, right? Um, you know, when we pray for the, the blessings of liberty that we have in the United States, I also can't help but to think of all of our brothers and sisters in faith throughout the world. Um, and um, Sir Jan, while you're not in the United States. I think you're in Canada right now. Um, I hope that, um, I hope you enjoyed all those prayers. And I certainly appreciate you being here and sharing your prayers and your comments in the chat here. So good to have you here. Um, there were, I know there were a couple others. There was one gentleman from Ireland who joins once in a while. I can't tell if he's on or not. Um, but, um, but I'm, I'm great, grateful for everyone who's here, no matter where you are in the world. Um, Sarah, good to see you. As always, cranking away with your studies. <laughs> it was good chatting with you online over the weekend, too. Got to hurry up. Three years. That's too long. You got to make it two, right? <laughs> um, and Lynn and a couple others I see on um, on Instagram. So good to have you all uh, joining live. You know, um, I, I spoke a few weeks ago. Actually, I think it was Memorial Day weekend when we were, we were um, remembering all those that gave their life for this country. Um, and I talked a little bit about the Declaration of Independence and our Constitution, and I thought, being the 4th of July weekend, um, I couldn't let this weekend go by without um, just at least mentioning the Declaration of Independence briefly. Um, and if you'll indulge, I'm going to read you three sentences from the Declaration from of, of Independence. So again, this is the American Declaration claiming independence from Great Britain back in uh, 1776. So, of course, signed on July 4th, 1776. These are the first two sentences. When in the course of human events, it becomes necessary for one people to dissolve the political bands which have connected them with an one another and to assume among the powers of the earth the separate and equal station to which the laws of nature and of nature's God entitle them, a decent respect to the opinions of mankind requires that they should declare the causes which impel them to the separation. We hold these truths to be self-evident, that all men are created equal, that they are endowed by their creator with certain unalienable rights, that among these are life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. You know, what I love about those two sentences is, is God has called out twice. <laughs> Right in that first sentence, and again in the second sentence, um, nature's God called it. And, the, and if you look at the Declaration of Independence, that's God with a capital G. Um, so it's it's pretty neat that um, that that's the basis of the founding of our nation. And then, of course, in the second sentence, um, um, affirming that our rights are given to us by our Creator, 
not by a government, not by a king, not by a parliament or a congress or anything. Our rights come from our creator. So I just love those two sentences, and I hope that everyone appreciates um, what they mean. And I think I'll close out tonight. Um, we went a little bit long, of course, because of the nature of this prayer, but I'll close out tonight by reading the last sentence of our Declaration of Independence. I think it's so important um, that we that we work together. I love this last sentence. And for the support of this declaration, with a firm reliance on the protection of divine providence, we mutually pledge to each other our lives, our fortunes, and our sacred honor. We mutually pledge to each other our lives, our fortunes, and our sacred honor. I love that. Thank you so much for joining tonight. I'm so glad to have you here. Happy 4th of July weekend, everybody. Um, I'll be back again next Monday, July 12th, I believe that is. I'm glad you were here helping us to fertilize the world with Hail Marys. We'll see you again next week. Good night. God bless you.